Another approach to composing a segment of music is to start out with a melody. For this approach, ensure that the Set Melody button is selected and that all the rules of harmony are turned on in the checker panel. As a demonstration, let's take part of the melody from Mozart's Clarinet Concerto. In this segment, the melody starts on a D major chord and ends on a G major chord, and our goal is to harmonize the entire melodic phrase. I can start with an evenly spaced voicing for D major, and then move the square cursor to the next melody note, which is an E. To harmonize this note, I select it from the Soprano drop menu and set the target key to D major, since the key signature is D major. At this point, the Chord Options window will list all the chords that contain the requested melody note. By selecting one of these chords and pressing Find, I will get a list of voicings for the chosen chord having E in the soprano. To help me choose one of these voicings, I can use criteria such as chord texture or bass motion. Let's try to duplicate Mozart's rising bass line by choosing a 7 chord in first inversion so that the bass note rises to E. I select this chord and press Find. This generates one voicing, which I add to the score by first clearing the contents of the beat and then pressing the Add button. The next melody note is D. After selecting the melody note and target key, I can see a new set of chord options in the drop menu. If I look at the chord wheel, it shows that the most desirable chord after a 7 diminished chord is either a 1 or a 6 chord. I choose a 6 chord in second inversion to obtain the rising bass line. As you can see, there are no available voicings for this chord, so I decide to remove the diminished fifth rule and search again for possible chord choices. The third choice chord produces one voicing, so I add it to the score. The next melody note is C sharp. At this point we need to look one step ahead. We know that the last note, B, must be harmonized with a 4 chord. By looking at the chord wheel, we see that after a 6 chord, the recommended chords are the 2, 4, 5, and 7 chords. Furthermore, of these 4 chords, only the 5 chord leads to the 4 chord. so 5 would be the only recommended chord for the C-sharp. However, Mozart does something different. In order to create a stronger transition to the 4 chord, he uses a 1-7 chord with the C-sharp melody note. This illustrates how the chord wheel recommendations need not always be followed. However, this will probably require suspending one or more rules of harmony in order to find a voicing for the non-recommended chord. With this in mind, I select a 1-7 chord in second inversion to preserve the rising bass line. As expected, this produces no results, so I decide to forfeit the preparations rule. Now I have three voicings to choose from. I select the one with the higher bass note and add it to the score. The final melody note is B, and this is harmonized with the 4 chord. I'll select the first choice triad in root position. This produces two results and I add the one with the higher bass note. Let's navigate through the chords to hear the entire harmonization. This sounds very much like Mozart's orchestration. We could also have created this harmonization by starting with the bass line. By selecting Set Bass Note, I can specify the bass line that I wish to obtain and then experiment with the chord options until I obtain the desired melody note. The end result is the same, which is to create a formally correct harmonization which takes into account my choice of melody and or bass notes. It's worth noting that the Builder Panel provides a very helpful means for creating reharmonizations of a given melody. 
By changing the target key, which implies a temporary modulation away from the home key, a new set of chord options is obtained. These new chords are sometimes quite interesting and unexpected. Here's an example, obtained by changing the target key to F. As you have seen, Harmony Builder Professional provides the composer with a means to explore a vast number of harmonic options when composing a piece of music, as well as generating optimized voice leading for any chord sequence. Furthermore, the way in which the selection process is structured will lead to an increased understanding of the complex interaction between the fundamental components of music, making it an excellent instructional tool. We hope you enjoy discovering new harmonies and creating great compositions with Harmony Builder Professional.